But we do want to turn now to police in Connecticut. They're facing new fallout over that shooting of an unarmed couple inside their car. Protesters overnight marching to a local police station to voice their outrage. ABC's Will Reeve joins us with that story. Will, good morning. Good morning. What dramatic video of this incident shows the two officers shooting at the car from the front and the back now calls for justice. This morning, outrage taking over the streets of New Haven. Protesters demanding that the two officers who shot at an unarmed couple near Yale University step down. That could have been my little sister. That could have been, you know, my little cousin. That could have been me. Shocking surveillance video taken from different angles shows the moment two police vehicles pull up to a parked car and immediately open fire. Okay, the victim is in a red vehicle, one person shot. You can see an officer from Hamden Police Department arrive on scene, jump out of the car, and instantly unload a barrage of bullets. A Yale University officer shooting from the other side before sprinting away, not even taking the time to put his car in park. The crossfire hitting 22-year-old Stephanie Washington as she was sitting in that parked car. And then my girlfriend just yelling like, they shot me, they shot me, they shot me. Her 21-year-old boyfriend, Paul Witherspoon, next to her in the driver's seat. I mean, I heard gunshots and stuff before, but it's a different feeling of somebody shooting at you than the police shooting at you. Police say the officers were investigating a report of an attempted armed robbery early Tuesday morning when they spotted this red Honda. They thought it fit the description of the car involved. Stephanie! Authorities claimed the shooting happened because the driver made an abrupt movement and ignored commands. And according to police, there was no weapon inside the car. Stephanie Washington is reportedly out of surgery and in stable condition. The Yale police officer was also injured during the incident. Authorities unsure whether he was hit by a ricochet from his own bullet or a bullet from the Hamden officer. Both officers are on administrative leave pending review from the state's attorney. A lot of anger about this story. Will Reeve, thank yeah. you for your reporting. Appreciate it. You got it. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.